Good morning students. I am Gurpriya and today we will read about poem Kite by Harry Wen. Now let's study about poet. Harry Wen was born on September 24, 1898 in Yavapai country, Arizona. He graduated from Harvard University with an SB in 1922. He worked as a scenario writer for motion pictures and was chiefly associated with King Vider's film. Ben taught writing at the University of Arizona from 1938 to 1947 and founded the University of Arizona Press in 1960. He published his first book of poetry, Siesta, in 1931, and the urging of his children began writing children's book in 1949. He published The Little Hill, a book of poetry for children. Now, What are the learning objectives of reading this poem is? To know about the poetic device used in the poem, to critically appreciate the poem, to enhance our vocabulary. Difficult words in the poem are dive, source, tide, gust, slack. Brief Introduction of the Poem Kite The Kite is a short, melodious poem by Harry Ben. The poet begins with an exclamation of how bright a new kite looks against the blue sky when it plunges and snaps its tail. The poet uses a simile like a ship to compare its gliding motion. It looks as if it is sailing over the sea waves during the high tide. So here the poet has used the poetic device simile. Now let's read the poem para by para. How bright on the blue is the kite when it's new. With a dive and a dip, it snaps its tail. Here, the poet wants to explain that how a kite looks bright on a clear sky when it flies for the first time. It moves with softness and force together at the same time. To fly makes a tail to create a cracking sound in the air. Then soars like a ship with only a sail, as over tides of wind it rides, climbs to the crest of a gust and pulls, then seems to rest as wind falls. Now here the poet wants to describe that when such moves help it to float in the sky, just waves rising and falling with the sudden blow of the wind. It makes it go up to the highest point in the sky in a wavy manner. The way of a ship moves on the ocean. But as soon as the wind slows down, it seems as if it has stopped there to rest. Next, when string goes slack, you wind it back and run until a new breeze blows and its wings fill and up it goes. Here the poet wants to explain that when the thread tied to the kite loosens, the flyer runs and rolls it back. He waits till a new breeze blows again and fills its wings with air again to help it fly high. 
How bright on the blue is a kite when it's new but a ragged thing you never will see when it flaps on the string in the top of a tree ragged means torn or tattered okay beta now here the poet wants to explain this a kite looks very bright and beautiful on a clear sky but when it gets struck on a tree top it gets torn and gives a poor worn outlook which is not liked by anyone i hope you've understood the poem thank you